French unions on Tuesday called for public workers to stage one of the biggest protests in decades, hoping to exceed the 800,000 people they brought into the streets last week in an uprising against President Emmanuel Macron's pension reforms. Commuters grappled with widespread transport disruption as a strike entered its sixth straight day, with schools closed in Paris, airlines cutting flights and power outputs dipping overnight. The union shows no sign of backing down in a battle that would define Macron's presidency, who is determined to simplify a system of more than 40 pension plans that provide some of the world's most generous benefits. The unions are calling on rail workers, doctors, teachers and other public workers to turn the screws on Macron before his government unveils its proposals on Wednesday. The strike is among the biggest since 1995 when Prime Minister Alain Juppé was forced to abandon an overhaul of the pension system after weeks of industrial action, a defeat from which he never recovered.